My name is Steve Trainer. Um, I run Barbarian Agency and we represent a Liberté. Um, the Barbarian Agency has been around for like five years or so and the desire to kind of do something that was formulated around building brands that had compelling stories. So you have to have like a really strong, compelling story to sell a great product. Um, and that kind of started the search for brands that I felt could be evolved into um, great brands. Stuff that had like the initial kind of pieces that could be gestated to basically become great, compelling both product and storytellers. We took on Liberté um, 14 to 16 months ago and it kind of all came back to the fact that they were producing something in a country that no one had successfully produced before, Africa. So they basically were um, making artisan-based products um, in a third world developing country, um, utilizing the farmers that would raise um, the animals that they would produce the skins from. Production happened in a factory based there. Um, they are supplying jobs to the local families and workers and it was causing like, this amazing economic catalyst toward the localized community that we were just hooked on. We were like, we have to represent you. We believe in it. And I think sometimes there's a level of emptiness in fashion. You're like, oh, it's a great product. I can wear it. It fits great. But sometimes there's a lacking in the story. So the story was so strong that we saw the developmental process on aiding and making the product great and putting it to the right doors was something that we really wanted to be involved with. One of my favorite styles is the Mugato High. Um, reason being because it's, I feel like there's a contemporary side to it where anybody can wear it. Um, like both the 45 year old guy or the 18 year old can understand the shape of shoe. This second one was actually the, the style that the brand should use to kind of change its major direction. Um, the sole was vastly different on a lot of the other stuff. And then they came out with this kind of this wedge crepe based sole, and they're like, let's do a three hole chucka boot. And this is the um, Adibo. This is a really exciting one because it changes the direction, or shows the change in direction for Liberté. One of the things that we've seen is that the brand has an amazingly responsive both urban and contemporary based fashion customer. That's where the shoe comes in. I think in the end, if you have a product by itself but with no story, it's kind of empty.